Hey, everyone. How are you all doing? I'm really excited to share something amazing with you today. It's called Lingai's, and let me tell you, this tool is a game changer. It can translate your website into over 80 languages instantly. So, you might be wondering how Lingai's manages to achieve such accurate translations across your website. Well, let me break it down for you. Lingai's is actually a WordPress plugin that is seamlessly integrated with a SaaS platform, also known as Software as a Service. This powerful combination enables the automatic generation of high-quality translations. Here's the magic. The Lindice plugin establishes a direct connection between the translation tool and your website. This means that whenever new content is added, the tool automatically detects it and translates it, ensuring that your entire website is consistently translated. And the best part? You have full control over the translations, as 100% of the automatic translations are editable. But wait, there's more. The entire process is not only accurate but also incredibly fast. How? Well, Lindize employs a top-notch neural machine translation tool that utilizes advanced translation models and optimization techniques. This ensures that the translations are of the highest quality, even though they're generated automatically. In this video, we'll explore how to translate your WordPress XML sitemap on a WordPress website, but that's the same process for all CMS. We'll also see how to add your sitemap on Google Search Console. So, without wasting any more time, let's jump right in and get started. Enough of the preview. Now, let me walk you through the process of creating a Lingdise account and obtaining the API key, so you can install Lingdise on your WordPress site. To begin, you'll need to access the Lingdise website. I'll provide the link below in the description for your convenience. Once you're there, click on the button that will redirect you to the registration page. I should mention that Lingdise offers a full month trial without requiring a credit card, so you won't have to worry about canceling any subscription if the trial period expires. After registration, which is a straightforward process, I believe I don't need to guide you through it, you can either register using your Google or Microsoft account or create a dedicated account specifically for your website. For now, I'll be using one of my Google accounts for a quick demonstration. Once you've completed the registration, let's connect Lindice to your WordPress domain by following these steps. First, click on the Add Domain option on your Lindice dashboard. Then, retrieve your domain's URL, which in this case is your WordPress site, by copying the URL link and pasting it in the designated field. Next, choose the base language for your page, and you're all set. The final step is to copy the provided API key and return to your WordPress page. Navigate to the Lindice plugin in the left navigation bar. Paste the API key into the main settings and apply the registered API key. And just like that, you're ready to explore the amazing features of this plugin. An XML sitemap is a file where you provide URLs of the important contents of your website. Search engines like Google read this file frequently for a faster URL index process. In multilingual websites, sitemaps are essential because if you add like 10 languages to a website that has 5,000 pages indexed, that would be 50k pages to index. To send to search engines information to focus on important pages, sitemaps are required in the first place. Once your sitemap has been generated, now it's time to generate your multilingual sitemaps by language. For that purpose, we will just update the language tag in the URL. I'll demonstrate how to translate your sitemap via two available plugins on WordPress. The first one is Rank Math and the other is Yoast SEO. Of course, as I've said, the process is the same for all extensions and for all CMS's sitemaps are just a standard XML files. Lindys is making translation of the content of the website but also URLs, it means that I'll be able to translate it and generate a sitemap. Also, it's important to mention that it works in the same way for all sitemap content types like page sitemaps, image sitemaps, video sitemaps, news sitemaps, mobile sitemaps. Just one last technical point about sitemaps, there are three major sitemap formats provided by website builder tools, a single sitemap XML file that lists URLs, then there's the sitemap index that is basically a list of some XML sitemap files, and finally dynamic sitemap URLs. It's good to know that Lingdice handles all three. Let's open a sitemap index provided by RankMath plugin 
you'll see a list of all the URLs that your page has. By clicking on a URL, you'll be redirected to that page and can see all the content it has to offer. So, here is how you translate a sitemap, you can directly edit the sitemap URL in the address bar and insert the language tag inside it. For example, I'll insert the French language tag, that is FR, in the URL like this. And all my sitemap URLs will be translated to French. I can also try other language tags, such as DE for German or ES for Spanish. If I open a URL from this translate sitemap, it'll open a translated page with its proper URL attached to it. As for the Yoast plugin, you can also do the same as the rank math. The plugin also generates a sitemap index with all the WordPress content types like pages, posts, custom post types. So, I can open a URL and change the language tag to translate URLs. Then, I can access to all the pages with the translated URL in your sitemap. Now that I've checked that my multilingual sitemaps are properly generated, you'll need to add a translated sitemaps URLs to the Google Search Console. It works in the same way on other webmaster tools like Bing Search or Yandex, for example. The purpose of that is to give to search instruction to crawl important URLs of your website, but also to instantly crawl new page URLs when it's added to the sitemap. It has a significant impact on international SEO, I can guarantee that. It's even recommended in Google International SEO official documentation here. Lingguys is generating SEO-friendly multilingual URLs associated with canonical and alternate URLs per language. That's all is required for your multilingual pages to be indexed. All your pages translated using Lingguys Cloud AI translation will be 100% indexed, so you can then find them in the Google Search Console performance menu. To add a new international sitemap URL, just click on the sitemap menu in the left column, then copy the URL of your sitemap. Here I'm going to copy the French URL, for example, and validate it. That sitemap URL will be crawled in a few minutes by the Google bots for further analysis. If you already have sitemaps crawled in page indexed, you can click on it, then on see page indexing, then again on view data about indexed pages. Here, you'll get details of indexed international URLs. I think we're done with the sitemaps. Now let's let's see the Lingdice translation prices and conclude in the next sequence. To wrap things up, let's take a look at the pricing for the plugin. In addition to all the plugin features we just covered, Lingdice got all the tools you'll ever need to elevate your business online rank. The plugin also fully integrates with WordPress, WooCommerce, all CMS baked on PHP and soon auto-hosted CMS like Shopify. Lingguys is quite affordable regarding maintenance fees, with start package for just $15 per month. But if you want advanced usage, the $25 Pro package would cover it. And lastly the large package for $45 with unlimited access and no restriction on translation volume. Every new domain has a free month of translation without credit card, so it's risk-free. The yearly memberships are even more affordable with the equivalent of one additional month for free. Thanks for watching this video. If you're watching this video from YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to our Lingice channel to stay informed about new plugin features and ask us any questions using the comments. And of course, you'll find all the useful links we've talked about in the description. Have a productive day, bye.